Hi everyone, Rob here again from the Department of Education at Cape Breton University. In this video, I am going to show you how to embed a Flipgrid topic board into your Moodle course. For an example of what a Flipgrid topic board looks like, in the uh, Welcome to Transitioning to Online Learning course that I am helping to build here, I have an example Flipgrid board built in. I have it under Introductions which is just set up as a standard web page and you can see that I've got the Flipgrid board built right in here so that uh, you can actually your students can actually record their responses right from inside of Moodle. I'm going to show you how to set that up. So the first thing that I need to do is turn editing on in my course and I'm going to set up a page to add this onto. So I'll go down to my um, working with video and web conferencing module here and I'm going to add an activity or resource and I'll select page and this is going to be demo of how to insert Flipgrid so I am going to skip down to the page content and I'm just going to put a placeholder here the word here and you'll see why I'm going to do that in a moment. Now, I'm going to go back to my Flipgrid uh, account. I have an account already set up here, and I have uh, some videos set up for my courses at Cape Breton University. And here is one that I've created for the uh, Transitioning to Online Teaching course. So there's no responses to this one yet but I'm going to click on the share option for this one. It gives me a code to share, but I'm going to select this here, copy the embed code. I'm going to come back into my course. I have my placeholder. Now, if I were to just enter this embed code here, then it's not going to make any sense. Uh, it's not going to work. I have to actually switch from my standard rich text editor. If it's not showing up, click this little icon here for more toolbars. And I have to switch to HTML view. So I just click on this edit HTML button right here. It's the two little arrows. Now, I'm going to take this code that I got and I'm going to paste it over the word here. This is why I put that uh, the text there. If I had a lot of text on this page, I'd just look for my little placeholder and I'd paste the embed code there. So my embed code is now in place. I can delete this extra text that I don't need. And I'm going to modify some of these parameters. Right now, it's uh, the embed code gives you an automatic width of 600 pixels wide by 600 high. I like it to take up the entire width of the screen, no matter how wide the screen is. So I'm going to actually change this 600 pixels here to 100 percent. Be sure to specify the percent size. And you can modify the height too. I wouldn't uh, put a percentage in for height, but 600 is a bit narrow, so I'm going to change that to 1,000. That should give me enough height. I'll hit update. It's going to embed everything in here for me. Make sure I set my activity completion the way I want it. Uh, do not indicate activity completion for my standard content pages. And if I hit save and display, you'll see that my Flipgrid uh, topic board is now embedded into the page. My students can view this. They can hit the plus sign. It is going to launch the uh, Flipgrid application for them, ask them to sign in with either Google or Microsoft, and then it will allow them to record their video right from inside of Moodle and save it into the Flipgrid account.